Hi everyone, welcome back to our channel. My name is Naz and I'm Alba and today we are taking you on another episode of the beautiful island of Menorca. Today we're going to take you to one of our favorite places in the whole of the island. This place is called Pinibeca and the reason why we love it so much is because one, the little town, the little white town is gorgeous but also because there's a spot where you can snorkel with thousands of fishes. Hopefully it'll be like that today. <laughs> yeah, hopefully the weather is good. So we're excited to show you those kind of secret spots because not everybody knows about them. So let's go. We've just finished our swim in the natural swimming pools of Bini Vega and it was pretty nice. No? Yeah, it was pretty awesome. As you could see from the footage, there was a good number of people there. I don't know how because this place is not even on Google Maps. Uh, <laughs> It's called the we call it the piscinas of Binibeca or the sw the natural swimming pools of Binibeca, but it's not like that on Google Maps. So we'll put the location right here so you know. Yeah, but even if there is a lot of people, the um, swimming area is quite wide, so you can just swim out and then uh, you'll pretty much be like alone. And there was also fishes, nothing too special but it's really really nice because the water was like cl crystal clear yeah it's so crystal it's incredible the visibility that you get uh, on the fishes is in is so so good but anyway we're on to the next stop and we are going right now to a, another cala that's called Calo Blanc and we really love this one it's also surrounded by rocks but usually it's really really blue so and the difference is that on the piscinas de Binibeca you don't touch the floor it's mm -hmm. pretty deep and yeah. you don't touch the floor and it's full of rocks whereas uh, where the place where we're going it's sand yeah, yeah so let us show you that sand. as well We were a little bit unlucky with the Scalo Blanc because today yeah. the wind was blowing south and that meant that it was a little bit wavy and there was a little bit of trash in the beach uh, or in that area but no, we've caught it in really nice days so we still yeah. recommend you to visit. We made it to Binibeca Vale, uh, which is a little town, a little pueblo of Binibeca. And we've been exploring, we've been here many times before, and we know that this, this little town is full of white traditional buildings that kind of resemble Santorini. Yeah, quite a lot. If you've seen photos of the famous uh, Santorini towns, all white houses, this looks pretty similar and it's so beautiful to walk around. You have to be quiet because people live here <laughs> um, or spend the summer here. And it has a beautiful port as well mm -hmm. um, that the houses lead to. It's just absolutely gorgeous. You can have lunch here as well, but if you do want to do so, uh, make sure to book <laughs> because we just walked past and everything seemed pretty full. Yeah.
When we came back, the first thing we did was getting ourselves in the pool. It felt so good to get in the water and get the salt out of our bodies, but mainly just get refreshed because it was really hot. We really enjoyed our time in Vinibeca. It was quite hot to visit Vinibeca Vel during the day. Um, so you could do the beaches during the day and then the town at night when it's <laughs> less hot, the sun is going down. It's also really nice at sunset time. But this was our experience in Binibeka. We really enjoyed it and yeah, we're probably gonna go back some other day. It's such a beautiful area to visit if you are coming to Menorca, especially if you are in the north or area of Maon because it's really close by. So don't miss this place in your trip to the island. And that's gonna be everything for this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far, don't forget to give the video a like. And let us know in the comments, do you think Binibeka is worth visiting or do you think that other places that we've shown in our videos are better? Uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel because we are not done with Menorca. We've got a couple more videos coming up and... Yep, that's it. Thank you everyone, everyone for watching and we'll see you in our next video.